because in in Ezekiel yeah. there's a huge temple that is referred that is described by God massive temple it's like ten, miles and miles wide never been built but it's described in such great detail some like some uh, some church fathers like Saint Augustine I think say well it's a symbol <coughs> maybe a symbol of Christ I can't remember if it's Augustine who says that but that symbolic interpretation I don't don't believe it no no because it's too detailed it's like yeah. it's like an architecture an architectural drawing almost yeah. so I think it will be built and that's that's why one of the reasons I believe in a a millennium as the book of Revelation says Christ before the second coming there'll be a kind of a, there'll be a kind of second coming where Jesus defeats the Antichrist and then there's a millennium and th after the thousand years then there's a final judgment of the whole human race but in that millennium there's a um, a new temple and that's where the Jews who converted to the Catholic faith they'll all be Catholics since this is a new Israel we're not going to go and belong to old Israel they've got to come into new Israel which is the church. Mm, the church. And only the Catholic Church. Yeah. And so then, yeah, someone will grab a hand of a Jew to go to the temple because that's, that'll be their homeland. <coughs> I think they, they long for the resurrection of the temple because that was part of their identity, the temple. Now they are left only with their rabbis. Mm. <coughs> Problem is, they have to get rid of the um, you have to get rid of the, the Talmuds and all that kind of stuff because it distorted their religion distorted yeah. mm. 